Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> ah. Sorry I'm late. I was having lunch with Julia Phillips and <laughs> we were talking about you. Well, once again, here at, the, here at the Oscars, just when I thought I was out, they pulled me back in. <laughs> well, we're here to have fun tonight, so let's put this all in perspective. It really doesn't matter who wins, because no matter who wins, Saddam Hussein will claim he did. <laughs> but I think all of us feel that we are very thankful that there are no Americans tonight fighting anywhere. except at Paramount. But, <laughs> but what a night, you know, everybody wanted to be on the Oscars this year. Madonna called me herself and she said, Bill, who do I have to fax to get on this show? <laughs> so she faxed me and I faxed her twice and she's here tonight. <laughs> so ladies and gentlemen, three, four, five, nothing Nothing compares uh, with hosting this show. Uh, you come out on this stage and you feel like the Norman Schwarzkopf of show business, and it's a thrill to look out at this great audience of all of these famous faces and people I love to watch work and hope to work with. Great actors like Al Pacino, Richard Harris, Jeremy Irons, who's sitting over there, nominated for Reversal of Fortune, the Donald Trump story. Kathy Bates, who is so great in misery, sitting right over there. I'm your number one fan. I am. I have, I actually have the misery home game, which is a, it's a home hobbling kit. It's, um, I'm referring to that great scene when Kathy took a sledgehammer and she crippled the legs of a writer so he couldn't leave and he had to finish his manuscript, which is not an original idea in Hollywood. It's, um, it's page eight of the Katzenberg memo. Okay, so I won't work there, but you know, <laughs> a lot of the nominated pictures have uh, interrelated themes. Now, follow me on this one, will you? Okay. You have Goodfellas, Godfather 3, the movie's about guys who kill people, and Ghost was about a guy who gets killed, and then there were the serious illness group. You had Reversal of Fortune, about a woman in a coma, Awakenings, about a man in a coma, and Dances with Wolves, released by Orion, a studio in a coma. So, we have all of those. Whoa, I made it too. NEM, I made it all the way through that joke. But I think the best title, and perhaps confusing to some people, is Dances with Wolves. Now, it's the name in that film, if you haven't seen the film, for the two of you who have not seen that picture. It's the name that the Indians gave to Kevin Costner's character when they saw him running and romping with his pet wolf. So they named him for something that he did. It's unusual to some, but we did the same thing to my relatives and my family. Uh, my house, we had eats with his hands, <laughs> spits when he talks, <laughs> and cheats on his taxes. So I think... <laughs> you know, last year we didn't have we didn't have an opening number last year, so I sort of made fun of the traditional Oscar production number where they take the titles of the best pictures and they put them into one sort of, pardon the word, cheesy kind of medley, but we had a great opening number tonight, choreographed by Debbie Allen. <laughs> so, so tonight I won't be able to do my bad medley. I won't be able to sing, it's a wonderful night for Oscar, 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 who will win? The nominated pictures are... All right, here we go. Are you ready? Hey, watch me now. So you whack someone and stuff them into your trunk. Good fellas, and you hold it down. Good man, it really stunk. Good fellas, then you whack that kid to shoot. And you shot some other guys too. And instead of feeling guilty, you said, let's have more food. Dances with wolves. I can't believe that he dances with wolves. 
hard to conceive, but he produced, directed, and starred in this movie. So if he wants to dance with a wolf, chances are he's gonna dance with a wolf. He likes to dance with G. It's for that little ghoul in you. H is for that haunting thing you know that you do. O S is for the noms for Oscar. T for tickets, man, it prospered. Ghost, can it win this lottery? Ghost, made me take a pottery. Ghost, it was made for me and. This is the story about a man named Corleone. This man killed everyone, so now he's home alone. <laughs> Not a very nice guy, shot Mo Green in the eye. So tell me why his hair is seven inches high. Godfather three, let there be more. And put Duval in Godfather four. When you're in a coma and the doc gives you El Dopa, Awakening Happy to be up now You're as cheerful as a pup now Ooh Ing Who knows Who will win the Oscar Only Bryce Waterhouse can say Jilly, get the limo, we're going home So If you want the Thank you.